Hi everyone. Today we'll be answering potential Java interview questions related to wrapper classes. So without further ado, let's get started with the first one. What are wrapper classes? Java is not a pure object-oriented programming language because it contains eight primitive types such as int, byte, short, etc. To move it closer to a pure object-oriented language, engineers that have developed Java added wrapper classes for all primitive types. Apart from value of these primitive types, wrapper classes also have some additional utility methods. Here you can see all corresponding wrapper classes and their class hierarchy. Primitive types cannot be used as type arguments when we defining generic types and that is one of the main reasons for introducing wrapper classes. In the shown example, we can clearly see that when we try to define a list of ints, we get a compile time error reported by Java. Another common usage of wrapper class classes pops up when we want to assign null value to a primitive type, like we tried here for a double variable number. Bear in mind that all wrapper classes are final and immutable. What is autoboxing and unboxing in Java? A really nice feature has been introduced since Java 5 that will either convert a primitive type to its corresponding wrapper class, which is called autoboxing, and on the opposite we have unboxing, which will unwrap wrapper class to a primitive type. We have shown these two concepts in the display example where autoboxing method will convert variable number of type int to an integer wrapper class. Unboxing will occur when we later assign return value of unboxing method to variable number. We will summarize this video with the following table that maps primitive types to their corresponding wrapper classes. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it and you would like to see more content of this type, please click the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. If you have any questions, post them in the comment section below and we will try to respond as soon as possible. Till next time, goodbye.